Turning now to a developing story we first broke Friday evening. A driver shot in the face outside of a Walgreens near FM 529 in Queenston Boulevard. Tonight, the accused shooter, Charles Garza, is behind bars. He made his court appearance this afternoon. Channel 2 Sally Mamdu live from downtown Houston with the very latest. Sally? Cian Garza is facing an aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. This is his first court appearance since the shooting on Friday. And right now you're looking at video of Garza at this hearing. Most of the time he kept his head down. We are getting a brief insight through court documents as to what two witnesses told investigators they saw at the time of the shooting. Court documents reveal that on Friday the victim had pulled into the Walgreens on FM 529 to drop off some friends. And that's when Garza pulled into the parking lot and started honking at the victim. Garza then got out of the tow truck, approached the victim who was still in his car, shouted an explicit word, then shot the victim in the face and fled the scene. Garza worked for a DTEC repossession and was driving the company's tow truck at the time of the shooting. And despite making his first court appearance today, a motive as to what led up to the shooting remain, remains unclear. Does this appear to be some sort of road rage episode? Neither the dim summary nor the um, complaint actually indicates kind of what preceded it, other than all of a sudden they're at the Walgreens and then this defendant is not happy with our complainant. Right now, the victim is still listed in critical condition. Garza's bond was set at $30,000. We're live in downtown Houston. Sally Bemdu, KPRC, Channel 2 News. A woman's